What does reality want me to do? That would be a good way to ask what to do next, even to ask for help in what you need to do next. As I've said before, praying to the universe or, oh, what does the universe want me to do? That's, you know, that it's a cop out. The universe is very far out there. It has, we've kind of turned it into the new God. It's, uh, it has no bearing on your actual life. But what does reality want me to do? The reality that I'm living in right here. What can I do? What does reality want me to do? Or maybe you could um, say, what does the earth want me to do? When I hear that, I, you know, I kind of think, you know, that would have to be a little more collective. What does the earth want us to do? Or make it even more personal. What does my family want me to do? In, in, in the modern world, do we ever think of that? Like, what does my family want me to do? Maybe somebody in your family is mad at you. What do they want you to do? That's thinking about someone besides yourself. What does my community want me to do? What does my job want me to do? That's usually a simpler question. So maybe that's a good one to use because you can actually find out the answer. I mean, maybe you have a job description, but maybe it's just something really simple. Like, what does your job want you to do? You're a cash register, right? Stand there and ring up groceries like the best you can. Maybe you um, are a construction worker. Build with the very best integrity that you have. Life is not that complicated. It's tricky. We can particularly make it very tricky. But if we live in the reality of our lives, then we can find how to live our very best life.